Alright, I'm here to do a VHS update. It's Christmas Eve. I had nothing better to do. Um, first I wanted to give you a look at the stacks of VHS tapes that I have not watched yet. <laughs> so, my, my Christmas break will, will not be boring. Um, these, these are, like I said, just the ones I haven't watched. I have the VHS tapes that I have watched at another location filling up three um, floor-to-ceiling shelves, the, you know, the huge, massive former library shelves. I have them stacked uh, two deep in three big library shelves, and uh, they're outgrowing those. Um, these, over break, I'm going to be tearing down these piles because I don't like them, all the weight of them uh, being stacked 7,000 high. Um, I'm going to go through them, sort them out, divide them out around the room, and also pull out all the ones I haven't chronicled in this series of videos yet. Um, and just for completeness sake, let's move across the room here, take a look at my shelf of DVDs that I haven't watched yet. There's a few Blu-rays in there, too. But, um, similarly, I do have one big shelf in another location full of DVDs that I haven't watched, or that I have watched. So all of these I have not watched yet. And I'm going to, of course, get to those in this series of videos also. But for now, for this update, just a short update, let's move down here. I recently went to an antique shop and found a bunch of great old videos. There was someone who must have really liked Interglobal Video because they had a lot of them. Um, Castle of the Walking Dead, which is also known by another title. Um, Torture Chamber of Dr. Sadism, I think. big ugly sticker there that is permanently on there. Um, the tomb. Kind of ripped. The ultimate thrill. This is an interglobal video, just not of the same design. Nola Gay, this is, um, I think it was a TV movie. Mel Gibson's first film, how about that? <laughs> Summer City. Desert Assault which has an otherwise Italian title. And this one, which I've already watched, The Ghoul, also known as Night of the Ghoul, also known as The Thing in the Attic. Um, I think I have that on DVD and a multi-pack. Ones that are not interglobal. You know, evil. Steel Justice. And then a couple that I got elsewhere. This is a cut box. This was a big box video cut down to the um, plastic case here. Tragic, but um, then again, this was only, I think, about 65 cents. So, I'd rather buy it for 65 cents than not get it. Martian Chronicles Volume 3. I'm the kind of person that um, if there's 
cut boxes or boxes that are not in great shape or full of stickers. Rather than um, not have them, I'd rather have them. I'd rather give them a home than have them be treated like trash or thrown out with the trash. So, um, you know, I don't mind getting these. I'd, of course, like to have a better copy like anyone else, but um, 65 cents. Come on. Ghetto Revenge. This is actually a repackaged, retitled 70s film. I can't remember the title of it right now, but it was given a <laughs> an 80s cover there. And finally, for this update, Scout Merchant. This, I think, was a TV movie, but it has John Waters in it. And, um, Paragon video. I uh, pick up any Paragon videos I see, pick up any Interglobals I see. Um, I, just, I, I, um, I particularly like particularly like the um, the design, the uniform design on a lot of the uh, video companies. Anyway, that's all for now. I'll talk to you soon.